Thought code skills came out not too long ago and I'm currently using this skill to meta prompt and create other skills for me to improve my code base. Now the first skill that I recommend everyone gets is a skill writer. So something that actually helps you write skills in the right format. First one is using this website here, Skills MP. This is a open source website and there's this particular skill right here. So we can go git clone right here. You're gonna click into the skills MD go into code, then you can go ahead and copy this skill completely. Create a new file, skills.md, and in here I can paste in this skill. Now remember when we start up a Claude session, this name and description here is loaded into the metadata. We can go ahead and save changes here. So I'm gonna open up a terminal here on the right hand side, and I'm just gonna spin up a Claude session. Now before I do anything here, I just wanna double check that this skill is actually working in the way that I wanted it to. I'm actually gonna to go to the Claude code docs where they write out all best practices for skills. I want you now also add at the skills md file so you can see here claude is analyzing the skills md against skills writer best practices and then i prefer to do this rather than blindly trusting an open source project why not reference the claude code files directly so you get the best possible output so you can see many changes were made now the skill md file is now capital skill writer doesn't have a underscore these are just little things that are easy to miss and i find no reason why you can't actually take advantage of claude to help do these as well i want to create a new skill that helps us only use components that we have used in the past I can go ahead and hit enter. Now we can see that Claude has created a new component guard here and soon we'll create the skills MD file with the instructions. It's probably doing that right now. And lastly, it's gonna validate against the skill writer checklist because that is exactly what we have in here. 